All right, time now for a check of the forecast. KJ's joining us. KJ, I had to stand up because you're standing up. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to get up and, and down out of the chairs with the suit on and whatnot. Yeah. But we had a pretty good uh, forecast day today. The temperatures yes. weren't too hot. We did warm up a little bit, but the temperatures will be a little milder. Right, uh, pretty manageable to be out yeah. and about in the type of weather we had today, Fred. However, we're going to be throwing a few things for the week. So get ready for a mixed bag because it's going to be a little cool at times, sunny, then a little cloud cover, then boom, we're going to have some showers and much colder temperatures by the middle of the week. But I'm going to walk you through it all coming up right now, setting the stage for tonight. Nice and calm as you get ready for bed tonight. Temperature is not too bad. Low 60s across the area. Some of you already down into the 50s. Tonight is not going to be a dramatic drop in terms of temperatures by tomorrow morning. Many of us will start today in the upper 40s and then we'll quickly warm up. However, I cannot say the same for the mountains tonight. You see it here. We have a freeze warning in effect. This is for Watauga, Ash and Avery counties for tomorrow morning. It'll go in effect at 2 a.m. until about 9 a.m. Monday. Also, we have frost advisory in effect for Burke and Caldwell counties, more so in the higher elevations for that particular area. But just be mindful of some of those sensitive plants that you may have. You want to bring them inside or cover them. Overnight, many of us are going to be in the upper 40, Charlotte 47, Rock Hill at 47, Boone 31, Lenore 38, and Monroe coming in at 49. Here's your day tomorrow. I want to take you through it here. We'll have nice and sunny conditions into the afternoon. A light breeze as well. That wind direction is going to change for tomorrow. Temperatures will still manage to warm up into the mid to upper 60s. By Tuesday, see we're going day by day. You see what I'm doing here? Tuesday is going to be another beautiful day. We'll have a mix of sun and clouds. Temperatures in the mid 60s. Of course, you're going to want to take in the nights at home against Norfolk before Charlotte. I lived in Norfolk. What a beautiful area. They're going to be in town for this week for that home stand beginning on Tuesday. As we move into your Wednesday, this is going to be the day that you're going to have to plan around because we'll have cloud cover early on. And then the rain is going to move in. It's going to be that persistent light rain likely into your Wednesday evening with much colder temperatures. And it's not the only wet day. Thursday will have a slight chance for showers. And here comes Friday. We'll likely have a wide spread rain event to move in by the end of the week and the rain chances are broken down here for you. Monday, Tuesday, you're dry. You're good to go there. Wednesday is going to be a likely chance for cooler temperatures. Rainfall Thursday at 30% and you can see some of those rain chances are going to spill over into the weekend. The guy roof and seven day forecast shows temperatures. You don't see 70s and 80s on the seven day forecast with the exception of one day. Our temperatures are coming in below average, well below average uh, into much of the week. Fred?